Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Spyro 2 Ripto's Raid to 100%. And in the continuation of this replay, I will be going through the first half of Autumn Plains by going through Crystal Glacier, Skelos Badlands, Metro Speedway, Zephyr and Breeze Harbour to 100% because they can all be done to that. Anyway, without further ado, it's time to go do it. Time to do, 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 do it. So let's go. Thumbs up, by the way. Oh, no. Couldn't really see it. Anyway, I don't appreciate the fact that the camera's, like, swaying that way. No, it keeps on doing it. I'll sort it out while this is on. There we go. Oh, it should be fine. Is it fine? I don't know. It keeps on like moving on its own. That should be fine. Yep, let's go. So obviously that's a direct reference to Colossus, but anyway, here we go. If you get on the catapult, we'll help you across the chasm. Let's go then, shall we? Boing! You want some ice wizards, huh? I flamed him. How dare you? There we go. Lovely. Watch. We'll help you climb this wall up ahead. Yeah. Obviously, I would show the animation of them literally sticking the forks in, but you know, there's no need for that anyway. I don't think it's going to grab that then anyway. Of course, this is the polar opposite to Skelos Badlands. And vice versa. Um, but, you know. That should be everything around here. Yep, it's pointing up to there. So let's go. I don't know why I bother trying to do that. Because, you know, yeah. There's not really any uh, thing... Not really any major things I could show off with the double jump. Uh, for... For Crystal Glacier, to be fair. So, you know. Just gotta get on with it. Don't get stuck, bloody hell. Uh, okay, whatever. I hit him. I'll charge him in the future then, I don't care. No. Yeah, sit down. Mate. Of course, if I fall down to that area, it's not really concerning. Because you've got those blooming weird green, green spider things, I forgot what they're called. Well, if you fall down the area where you've got a massive pit of goo, then that's the uh, that's the area you don't want to get to anyway. That's just unfortunate. Getting double teamed. Anyway, um, yeah. I mean, it's one of the shorter areas as well. Or shorter zones, I guess you could say. But anyway... Yaw. So obviously, um, if you watch my Mystery Dungeon videos and you know of what I was going to try and do, um, basically, the code I was going to put into the emulator is not a good idea, um, because I decided to quickly get to the end of one of the dungeons, and you don't get um, the cutscene and what not for the um, dungeon so when you defeat the boss of that area you know it's kind of kind of annoying so I've got I've got to try and unlock him legitimately but I don't know how I'm supposed to do the rest of the seven treasures um, if well I can't unlock him via Wonder Mail but what I'm gonna have to do as I said do the Zero Isle stuff, and yeah, anyway. 
Yeah, I'll just literally have to talk to one of them anyway. Here we go. Hold tight for a second and look out below. Lovely. Let's skip past that. There's no need to see that. Well, I guess there, there could be, but you know, it's fine. Yeah. Right, so now that's done. It's time to, you know, scout the rest of the area. Uh, come on, grab all of them. That should be everything for this area, so I'm going to go... Uh, do the George mission, where he's like, you found George. <laughs> I'll come back to that anyway. I lost one. Yep, you, you lost your pet leopard. George, you found George. <laughs> it's funny how he just says it, but anyway. This mission isn't really, well, it's not difficult, it's just, it's just time consuming and uh, very uh, annoying. Is that fish not going to come back up for now? Whatever then. You found George. <laughs> I will. I will be your master for now. You. You get me. You found George. See, I. You see, I remembered exactly what it needed to do. But you know, anyway. Yum. That's what that would have been. But anyway, let's check statistics. Two eight six. I don't know if that's right or not. Oh no, that's not good, is it? Oh no! Let's flame his tail. Urr, urr. Obviously, I've got to walk slowly once this is done. Anyway, let's, you know. Get somewhere better. There we go. This will be done for about the 8 minute mark. Um, anyway, I've got a kind of, you know. I don't have to walk with the screen like that, but you know. Do kind of, you know, need to do that anyway. Lovely. You found George. I'm so glad he's safe. I'll be sure to pay more attention to him from now on. All I have with me is this round, shiny thing I caught while I was fishing. You can have it if you like. You found George. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so sad as to remember all of this, but you know, probably because the amount of times I've played the games, but you know. Well, to be fair, I haven't played them too many times. But, you know, anyway. You found George. Rion. I'll get these now. And then I'll come back for the gems afterwards. So I'm being quiet because I would say something, but I know it'll get ruined by one of the last ones. But you know, anyway. Wow, that was a perfect, that was practically perfect, other than that one that came back randomly, but anyway, that was perfect. You have saved us all from a grisly fate. Please, accept this orb, it's a small token of our thanks. That's fine, anyway. You can't, you know, place isn't the best for orbs, because, you know, you only get two. But anyway. You found George. Yeah, I'm going to stop that now, but anyway. Right, it needs to get to 1800. And that'll probably be the suitable amount, won't it? Yep. Okay, there appears to be some up there, if I believe them. I don't know why, but anyway. You found George! Oh, here. <laughs> Idiot. How did I miss them out, anyway? Crystal Glacier done in 10 minutes. 
Well, really, that was like nine minutes, because obviously I had the minute intro and all that stuff. <laughs> oh dear, anyway, lovely. Ring. Don't know why I'm doing that, but anyway. Now it's time for Skelos Badlands, and I'll do Metro Speedway, then Zephyr, then Breeze Arbor. The the order I introduced it in is the order I'm going to actually do it in, because you know. Anyway, there is a uh, kind of big skip in uh, Skelos Badlands, which allows you to do the level backwards with a double jump. Anyway, of course you've got the bloody dragon one, but to be fair, it's not too bad because I can remember the order. Like, well, not well, not exactly, but you know I can remember the order to some extent. So yeah, those annoying flying cat bats or whatever they're actually called. Of course, there's a skill point for getting rid of all of them in that uh, last area that you get. Anyway. Down you go, you can't explode if your head's somewhere else. But anyway. Oh god. And you know, if you do that as well, you kind of create your own invincibility frame and you cannot be um, harmed by the cat bat fireballs. I forgot what they're called, whatever the skill point is called, is what those enemies are known as. It's like cat bat something. Look at that, invincibility frame. I don't know if that was intentional, to be fair, I don't know if a lot of things in this game are intentional, to be fair. But of course, these type of skips will not be in Reignited Trilogy, because, you know, any bugs in the originals, they'll make sure there are none, anyway. Of course, you're supposed to shoot up those rocks at them, but of course, you know, you know exactly what I'm going to do to get to them. And that's that. Oh, hello. Hit you with your special little attacks. Oh, news, I missed it. Right, there we go, lovely, anyway. I guess I could go for it backwards, but is there any need? Not really. I mean, I've hit the fireworks, but, you know. Right, time for one of the more annoying challenges. Because it still can be annoying, you know. Don't worry, I'll do it. Anyway. Do 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 do. No, 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 no. And then go around for this one. And done. Well done, Grasshopper. Take this shiny uh, thing we found to aid your journey. Yah, 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 yeetie. Yah, 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 yeetie. I'm just dancing in the background, but anyway. Uh -oh. Yes, I am, sire. Of course, this one's five star because this one's very fast paced. Got to be careful. I think I can remember the order. I always expect the sit. I think it's the sixth one to cut come out before the seventh one. And that's the mistake I usually make. But anyway, right. So get that one. Oh crap, it's over there! New! No. And I died because of it. Lovely. Anyway, I remember the order now. And then it's. 
No, I've got, why am I messing it up? I shouldn't be messing it up. I know how to do it. So it's that one. That, that one. Look at that, double kill. That one. That one. That one. It would help if you actually got him, because now those other two are going to get a bloody way because you're being a melon. <sighs> why, why is he missing? One. Two. Three. Four. Oh, why is the camera angle getting bloody messed up? Right, and then you go round here, then you get that one, and then... Get that one. Bloody hell. There we go, done. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. quickly itch, because I need to itch for some reason. Anyway, I don't know why I was showing the your bouncing animation. There's no need for that, but you know, anyway. Do, 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 do. Anyway, let's get one of those rocks. If you smell what the rock is cooking. Don't forget the bone. I don't want to forget to like grab any bones. Because that would just be a bloody annoying. Whatever, mate. That didn't go quite to plan, but it's fine. I don't know why the bones just randomly like bounce like that, but whatever. Anyway, oh no, I forgot to hit the firework. I'll just have to wait then. Boom, boom, boom. Bing. There we go, I can do this now. Yeah, man, then. There we go. What? Oh, come on, mate. That should have worked. Oh, no. I'm bonking me head everywhere now, look. Anyway. Anyway. Boing. There we go. It worked for that one. To be fair, I think you grab that one automatically anyway, but you know. That never works. You just jump and flame because they always manage to just hit you as you do it. Anyway, how many spirits do you actually get? 28. And I don't remember this level for some reason anyway. Why am I going there now when I might as well hit the bloody thing first anyway? Well, that's that. Just, you know, it saves gliding, I guess. Anyway. Grab all of that. Lovely. Of course, you get two of those annoying buggers around here, but, you know. Oh, my God, that's not what I meant to do at all. At all. There we go. Right, now I'm going to have to get bloody back to that area. So I'll run across. Might as well get this while I can and all. Because why not? Do 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 Yeah whatever. That's the way I think you're supposed to intentionally do it, but you could but anybody could easily just jump glide and flame it, but you know. I've noticed they give you a lot of leeway with that glide, don't they? I've noticed that, but anyway. Bonk. I believe this is the first of these magic pots. Just thought you might want to know that, anyway. Let's do it the genuine way, shall we? Anyway, the one I need to hit is the one on that bloody... on this whirlpool. Oh, it, it bloody lands there. I thought it landed in the... F oh, it must not do, anyway. That's helpful, I guess. Anyway, hit that. I want to make sure I grab absolutely everything 
here before I grab before I basically grab this bone. Because that would not be a good idea anyway. I'm guessing you might want to see him dance. I'm guessing you want to see him dance. Yeah, let's let's watch him dance, shall we? Oh, lovely, lovely. I'm guessing you can press triangle to watch that beautiful dance if you want to again. But anyway, I might as well take this chance and hit that gecko or lizard, whatever it is. Fire lizard. A flizzard. You see, if an icy lizard is a blizzard, then a fiery lizard should be a flizzard. But anyway. Ah, oh, I was hoping to be able to just continue to charge from there, but never mind. Anyway. Oh, yes, look at that, lovely. Anyway, that should be it. Yep. Oh, crap. I know what I forgot to do. I forgot to grab the bloody talisman. Luckily, I can get away with it and just do that while the glitch is active. You made it through the Badlands. I knew I'd win that bet. My cousin Gronk is a fool to bet against the dragon. Take this talisman for helping me out. Ah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Might as well go through the portal, innit? There we go. Skill of Badlands completed, innit? So stupid, but you know. Anyway, this might not take quite as long as I thought to be good. I mean, it's it's like ten minute a piece, roughly. But anyway, this shouldn't take too long. But yeah, with Zephyr, bloody hell, there's a massive glitch you can do to get all the way to the blooming area. You've got all the ones throwing the blooming TNT barrels, and then before you use the cannon to blow up the thing, and it'll crap. Yeah. I was too busy talking then. Anyway, yeah. As I said, I think this one's under 110 as well. I'm not sure though. Anyway, I like how they uh, did this speedway, but anyway. This is the bit that slows me down all the bloody time, I tell you. Got you. Right, get you. Get you. Get you. Get you. Get you. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, because now I can get you and then go this way, which is what I wanted to do, but anyway, probably not quick enough for the thing, but you know, that's fine, anyway. Well, that didn't bloody go to plan, but anyway. Oh no, that bloody balls is everything up now. I'm just going to have to do it like this, in I? Anyway, bang, 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 bang. See, and then I'll go in that bloody gate, but now I've got to do that and then curve round and then enter the gate. And then go boing, boing, boing. You see, I have, I have ways set out. It's just if it don't go... So I was like nine seconds off there. Anyway, obviously I need to I need to go back on for the uh, secret orb challenge. But anyway, lovely. We've been having a crime problem here in Metro Speedway, but I think you might be able to help. Yeah. The band of cat burglars have been raiding my re-election funds by scaling the walls of the buildings. Would you be willing to help get rid of them? Yes. Here we go. 
So, yeah, Hunter should be nice. Should be able to deal with him, you know what I mean? Yeah. 12 of them all together, of course. There we go, lovely. Uh, I could have got that bungee man, but it's fine anyway. Always used to fail this so much. I should be able to do it in one go, but I've got a feeling I'll mess it up because I'm doing it for YouTube. Because of the YouTube curse. But anyway, I like how it starts off so slow and then, you know, um, it just like, it gets a bit trigger happy, you know what I mean? Anyway. Well, I nearly bloody messed it up. I went the wrong way because I'm being an idiot. When, when I'm doing it for YouTube, I always make the camera go so bloody weird. I'll show you how the camera always goes. It's always like, always like that. That's how I move for some reason. It should be much better than that. Anyway, that's, I don't know why it's all shaky and quaky when I'm doing it. It's not like I'm actually like shaking. I don't know. It's just the camera movement goes wild. When I'm on my own, I'm fine. But I feel like when someone's watching... Or when I know someone's going to be watching, i.e. YouTube videos. I don't know, I just start... I don't know, I just start to play... Not as well. I don't know why. I've never been able to play well with um, other people, but you know, anyway. Well, not with other people, just when other people watch, but yeah, anyway. Obviously, getting right close up to Hunter like that is very helpful. Especially for this last one, because you can just go boing. Thumbs up, by the way. So yeah, that took like five minutes. Anyway, lovely. Do 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 do. Lovely. I like how they. I don't know if they planned it. They probably did, but I like how they just managed to get um twenty five levels exactly. Um. As you know, you get 10,000 gems in there. Oh, yeah, crap. I was going to glide in, but I forgot I didn't pay for Zephyr. But anyway, there we go. That'll do now. Legend has it that you are a greedy son of a bitch. But anyway. I could actually leave most of the beginning area. Because I'll be coming back with the thing. But anyway, it's fine. Anyway, here we go. Obviously, this is um, probably, well, no, I think it is the longest level in the game. So, you know, kind of have to be very, very careful and very quiet. Anyway, oh, lovely. Let's just defeat you, idiots. Yeah, dive over here. Bam. Do, do, do. Oh, you be doing kamikaze himself, anyway. I managed to actually get everything. Oh my god, speedrun tactics. Anyway, uh, yeah. Here we go. Yep, because obviously the birds stay still for me. Aim a bit higher, man. Bloody hell. Oh, that's a bit too high. There we go. And then... Line up a bit higher. Oh, no, I thought it was the same height for that. Maybe it isn't, then. There we go, that'll do anyway. I could have, you know, shot another cannon in, but I'll just break them that way. One, two, three, four, five, six. I could just use a double jump, but it's fine. And then go boing. And then go boing, there we go. Alright, that's got to be 89. Yep. Obviously, I could hit those annoying birds, but, you know, there's no need. Anyway. Ow. 
I think that's the first time I've ever been hit by a TNT barrel in this area. Well, probably at all in the game, I don't know, anyway. Get that bloody caterpillar. I'm guessing it's a caterpillar, just a blue one. But obviously, in Spyro, nothing has to make sense, so, you know. Yeah, you're pretty useless when you don't have your bombs, eh? We don't have your bums. Yeah, obviously this is a massive target. You shouldn't have to miss. You should. Well, you shouldn't be able to even miss it. I think usually what I used to do was just glide down, but I might as well do all this bit first. Just saves having to ever go back up here. I mean to this bit, but you know. Anyway. Didn't want to do that, so I wanted to charge into it, but whatever. There should be everything around here for now. No, oh, bloody hell, I just got sniped. I mean, this area just reminds me of Nort Cove. I don't know if they intentionally did that. So obviously they, they obviously did these type of enemies, but they also... Um, what's the word? I can't think of the word anyway. There we go, that's what I was waiting for anyway. Lovely. Kaboom! Anyway. Oh god, I didn't think he grabbed that then anyway. Should be everything right, yep. You son of a bitch. What? How did that not... Oh, whatever. I'm not going to question it. No, nope, that's everything. Right. Wow! What an explosion! Yeah. Sure is a good thing I have my helmet on. Oh, yeah. Uh, the colonel wanted me to give this talisman to you if you got through the freeze field of defences. Good job, soldier. Yeah. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
the double jump can basically destroy oh crap destroy any need of you know just needing most things anyway why was that such a weak double jump what how did that happen I don't know anyway Oh, I see. There's like a certain way they prevent you from jumping. Because I think you can glide all the way across there and they've put like a kind of barrier in to prevent you. I think that's what they've done anyway. I mean, yeah, the whole Zephyr puzzle, you know, I can just skip straight past it. Practically. Anyway, do you want to... Let's go to it. I'll get the cow lap over and then, you know... Oh, I'd have to be so bloody awkward. No, you don't, mate. Over there. Over there. I don't want to get him right down that bloody bit because that would be so bloody annoying. Anyway, line up properly. Oh, my God. I thought the first time in, like, ages the Kalec was going to be pushed out because the last time that happened, funny enough, is when I originally did it on YouTube. Um, it hasn't ever happened since. So that just shows, you know... Things happen differently on YouTube because of the YouTube curse. Obviously, back then I didn't used to say YouTube curse because really I've only I don't even think I've been saying it for like a year. But anyway, spiral. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Give me those bloody fruits. You get me? Give me those wampa fruits. So I actually don't even need that one there because there actually is a way you can jump onto that while it's forming. You don't even need to do a double jump. You know, I could show you, I guess, so I could keep this on me. But you know, anyway, I always do that on this platform. I don't know why, but anyway. And then when I don't make it, is when I release the momentum. Anyway. Please don't miss. Thank you. Do you know how much of a brain ache that would be if you missed? You know, you know we're just gonna just gonna place that somewhere over there. I don't really need it, but you know. Yeah, sit down, mate. Anyway. See, I could just probably do a double jump glide all the way over to the professor now, but there's kind of a few gems around that are needed. But anyway. Oh my bloody god, I nearly messed it up then. Anyway. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Anyway. Well done, my boy. Yeah. You've got two more seeds to get you the rest of the way. So uh, take this with you if you don't mind. It's been cluttering up my pockets. I like how he's the one who tells you to get orbs. But he's got orbs himself. You know? And I don't even need... Oh, well, I, don't, I think I might need one. And that's the one I've got now. Pens, no, I, I should be able to make that. Do, do, ah, oh, you see, I always release the double jump. Too early or too late. Oh, what am I doing, man? Let's not do that again, shall we? Alright, let's not release too early. Because you lose height that way. Ah, oh, there we go. Right. This should be the only one that I actually need to, you know, get anyway. Here we go. Romeo. 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 Wherefore art thou, Romeo? Oh, there's Romeo. You can have this. I don't need it anymore. I wonder what these blooming monstrosities will look like in the Ignite Trilogy. They're going to look blooming ugly as hell. They're going to look even uglier. Than some ugly people that I know, you know. Anyway, yeah, let's not let's not see that monstrosity flying over to Romeo. I mean, that means because obviously the Zephyr models are like the Breeze Harbor models in terms of the enemies, but these ones are the friendly ones. Those blooming weird slug things, you know, they're gonna be they're gonna be ugly. Anyway. Colossal 
He always go on about Colossus, have you noticed? Um, like, the glacial, uh, the crystal glacier ones mentioned that they bought tickets to go watch the hockey game. And they're on about the Colossus Idols. I don't know if that's supposed to kind of be some cheeky hidden reminder to go, you know, do them or not. But, you know. Yeah. Right, you two, you are coming with me because you are the most annoying things ever. Because your AI is programmed to move the opposite direction to wherever I'm facing. Not even moving, just facing. Half the time, and it, oh, that's a bloody annoying spot to be stuck on. And at least when you get them onto these type of areas, they can't just wander off. Oh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, all four of you, come on then, here we go. What's the time? 41 minutes. It's been like nearly 15 minutes so far. I mean, if it takes uh, below 20 minutes, you've done a good job. And obviously, speedrunners can get it done in like 5 minutes. The only problem with speedrunners is, obviously, it can take the fun out of the game through rushing it. But I think it's interesting just to, you know, see the skills that are required to speedrun. I mean, Spyro 2 speedrun, I guess, wouldn't be too bad to learn. I mean, I can do the tricks anyway. Hey, yep. Here's a little something. Whatever meat. Yeah. There are two more cowlicks. Yeah, I know. There's one here. There's one here. There we go. Well, I am impressed. You got all seven cowlicks for me. Here's a fair reward. I'll tell. I'll tell. Oh, Charles. Oh, Charles. Very appreciated. Anyway, what are we on? 3, 4, 1. I don't bloody know if that's enough. I don't know if there's 59 in the bloody... Magic... Uh, thing. Yeah, I think... I thought that originally, you know, there's a time limit on it. But I think it's just if you die, it gets reset. So I think I died, thought I just took too much time and it disappeared, but no, it stays there for as long as it's left. Oh, there's um, a few more already. 55C sounds reasonable, I guess. Why don't you drop down when I want you to? They drop down when you don't want them to, but you know, anyway, yeah, I've, I've noticed those greens now. Anyway, do, 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 do. And that should be all she wrote. Yep. That is Zephyr complete. Obviously, that's quite quite loud when I get a load of gems in one. But anyway, lovely. Lovely. It's always good to see how, like, most of the time, if there's like, if their world has been ruined by certain things, they always, you know, get their revenge. I mean, with Glimmer, you don't get to see those blooming <laughs> things, whatever they are. They're like lizards blooming because they obviously you don't have that type of thing for that. But anyway, Breeze Harbour, the final level I'll be doing in this episode, and I'll be moving on to Scorch Fractor Hills, Magma Cone, and. I've got its name all of a sudden. Shady Oasis. Obviously, two of them I can't fully do. But yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway. Right, if I don't get this first try, then... YouTube curse. Thank you. Breeze Harbour? Nah, I don't know what the full level looks like, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, I'll be going through it all, but you know, I kind of want to just do this first. See, obviously, as I said, I like to show off all these funky tricks. I mean, there is a way to get up there without even lighting the, uh, the boat or ship, whatever it is. Because you can double jump onto a part that's high enough for another double jump. 
Right, let's get the talisman. There we go, lovely. Thanks for getting our ship fired up, Spyro. Now we can proceed with our counterattack on Zephyr. Please take this talisman as a token of our gratitude. Yaw. Yeah. See, obviously, that's how these connect. Because, you know, they're in war with Zephyr. That's why the enemies look like the, Zephyr the Zephyrians, I guess you could say. Anyway. Meow. That should be everything, yep. You see, I could come back to this beginning bit once I've uh, destroyed the... Uh, Thing with a cannon, but you know, it's fine anyway. Do 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 and yeah, from here I can also get to the gear thing. You're not even going to see me on the trolley. Not really. Um, so you, won't, you shouldn't be hearing trouble with a trolley, eh? You shouldn't be hearing it at all. You know, anyway. Be lower down. Lovely. Anyway. Back onto there, and then, you know, here. Anyway. Boing. Boing. They're coming in. Come at me. Oh, what a shame. Anyway. Obviously, I don't even have to talk to uh, that Breeze Harbour... Rian. Anyway, just gonna aim it here. Done and dusted. I can go back to the beginning another time, but anyway, now I'm gonna go back this way and show you another cool trick. Just because I can, you know. And there is only two, isn't there? Yeah. Breeze Arbor, lovely, anyway. Do, do, do. Right, hopefully I can make it up here. There we go, right. So there is no count, because, well, I ain't actually in the trolley. I don't want to die because it gets reset. I don't want to miss one because when I enter the trolley, to basically to skip the whole challenge in the, like, completely. Um, you know, yeah. It'll go a bit wrong anyway. So I'm going to go all the way around this way. I'm going to grab that one so I don't forget it. I'm just taking a very specific path across. So I don't forget anything. As I said, I do not want to die. That would not be very helpful. If I fall, I'll just have to climb back up from somewhere. Anyway, that should be everything in this area. So now I'll take that tunnel area. I don't actually need to even, like, flame the thing for the ships, but, you know. Anyway, the hitbox on the gears are actually quite big, because it was supposed to be the hitbox for the whole trolley. Well, at least that's what I'm guessing, so, you know, anyway. Oh, I've messed up the old camera turning back now, anyway. You know, I could just imagine the thumbnail being one of these bits. Anyway, I don't want to go too close to the bloody trolley, either. Do, 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 do. And if I fell, I fell down there once doing this. So no, anyway, that should be everything. Oh no, I wasn't supposed to do that, was I? I wasn't supposed to do that. Idiots! Now I've got to do it all of bloody again. I messed it up. I was supposed to come round and talk to him instead of getting back in the bloody trolley. Idiot. I've got to mess it all up now. 
So I can salvage it. I can salvage it. Don't worry. I can do it all again that way. It's completely effed up the route now. Ah, oh, it's fine now. As I said, innate. Stop being stupid. Anyway. I guess it's my fault for wanting to show off these bloody tactics, but you know, I just thought it'd be something different to do, you know. I know it's that. Yeah, I thought it was. Well, I ain't got uh, many things to get now, but anyway. Anyway, you know, just avoid that whole area completely. Collect all of that. Before I do that, you'll see what I'm basically going to do. And it and it'll explain the reason why. So obviously this was where I would have um practically ended the uh challenge uh, and the level. And then I'd just go back for the yellow ones but I kinda of pulled it up for myself. Oh crap, let me let me realign it. There we go, that's what we wanted. Right. So from here I'd go back for the yellow gems, but now I've kind of got a bloody do in a different order. Anyway. We will try it again. Can I make this though? Yes, I can. Right, let's try it again, shall we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm just going to count. Thirteen. Fourteen. I shouldn't have to count, but anyway. Fifteen, sixteen, fifteen, nineteen. I'll count them yet. Okay, kind of forgot that one. I oh, know I can do it then. What's this anyway? Oh yes, I did. I managed to pull it. I managed to pull off that as well. You basically shoot the trolley. They will shoot with the trolley. And then bloody do that, oh, idiot! That's like a frame perfect shot. I managed to pull off, but I kind of messed it up, didn't I? Yeah. I feel I've lost count now. For some reason, I, well, I stopped counting. But that should be everything. And then what I would have done was got enough for this ability, then talk to him. That was great. Yep. <laughs> I kind of had to press triangle because I'd already spoke to him. But you know, that's how you do that. Anyway, I should have 300 yet, 360. Right, so I'm going to go this way back, you know. Oh, crap. I would have got it done a bit earlier, but, you know, never mind. Do, 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 do. I thought I messed that up then, anyway. Breeze Harbour completed, lovely. Showed off um, how you can basically break that level in half, but, you know, anyway. Seeing those cheesy cutscenes, anyway. That is half of Autumn Plains done now. And that does leave four levels in a speedway. After doing four levels in a speedway. But anyway. Let's kick the trust of the good guidebook. There we go. I do four levels, so Scorch. Why oh, have I forgot the name? Fracture Heels, Magma Cone, Shade Oasis, and then 
I think it's just called Icy Speedway, and then, of course, gulp. But anyway, of course, as I said, that does what the end of this episode. So, thank you for watching this episode of my playthrough of Spyro 2 Those Rage. And in the next episode, I will be finishing off Alton Plains, as I said. Well, of what I can do. Then yeah, as I said, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. When I do what I did. And I'll also see you tomorrow for... Uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Explorers of Sky, where I will be basically going through dungeons. Um, probably zero aisles for now, because I haven't got any of the other seven treasure stuff. But anyway, as I said, thanks for watching. Remember, massive thumbs up. All I've got to say to you now is goodbye and good night.